Hey everyone, Wanderer here. Welcome back to Skyrim. So, as I was on my way back to Solitude to turn in uh, this quest, I seem to have... I guess I went around this kind of weirdly. I guess I need to go over here to turn the quest in. Yeah, what's the Blue Palace? Right, it's in Solitude. Anyway, I guess I went kind of down and around and didn't go where I was supposed to, but I, I found this dainty slowed boat out here. I think it's maybe... A bunch of pirates. I don't know. Corsairs, huh? So they're not immediately hostile, but if I get up here, they're going to fight me. Oh, these are smugglers, I suppose. I'm warning you. Back off. I see skooma. Yeah, skooma everywhere. Hmm. I'm warning you. Back off. you don't mind if I just take these then, do you? That's close enough. Just take all your skooma. I'm warning. Back off. I think I'll just go where I want. Is someone there? Bad Bad this is a surprise. Uh, uh, okay. Not Another. that. Victory. Victory. For now. Should get my candlelight going as well. Got to get my regen going to here in a second. But in the meantime, I'm going to look around here for some skooma. See if there's any more on the deck here. Yeah, I suppose this is an illicit goods smuggling type ship. Guess we'll see what's here. Skuma is like my last resort. Wouldn't use it unless I really, really had All to. Right. Wanna go? These guys are pretty easy too, so I'll probably just uh, put on my one-handers for now. Let me see what else we have here. Dawnbreaker and... Oops, do I still use my my hunting knife? I think I do. Yeah, okay. Over here. Finish this. Enough. Get wrecked. It's a healing poultice, sure I'll take that. Wine. Not sure why it just now is popping up, but whatever. I don't know if you can even see the pop up on that. Nvidia Share, which is what I used to record, has been very weird lately. <laughs> you just say, do you have a death wish? Yeah, I agree. What are they doing attacking you guys? They're just gonna get wrecked. Singing a shanty, are we? Bye bye. Quite like one handed. It's pretty good. What was that sword? Steel sword, okay. Ooh, nice evasion. We're getting there. We're getting there, guys. Sometime soon we'll hit the evasion level 75 and then we can start using slow time. Just some crappy health regen stuff here. Nothing really impressive. Was hoping for more skooma. So I can use a bunch of drugs and become a very strong berserking orc whenever I need to. I know, we gotta go to bed soon. It's, it's getting late. It's been late for a while. Come 
Well done indeed. Or would you just you just like eviscerated that guy? Get wrecked. There's the footlocker key. No captain here? There's the key for that. Yellow Book of Riddles. Keep that for later. I haven't read that one. I have not read this one either, apparently. Uncommon taste. Isn't, like, everything about the, uh, gor the gourmand kind of... Or the gourmet, whatever his name is. Isn't, like, everything about him kind of... Like the joke is he's he's cannibalistic or something. Dance in the Fire, Volume Six. I have read that one. Oh, hey, look, it's uh, one of those things. One of those gems. Okay. Um. So that was the first mate. Is there anywhere else we can go here? We get to the captain's quarters? Or is there no captain? Or have I killed the captain? I didn't realize it. It'd be cool if you could take over and crew your own ship in Skyrim. This one's a bit leaky, though. Maybe not my first choice, you know? Okay, just a quick... fun... divergent type thing here. That's fine. <laughs> this mace is, uh, well, that's interesting. Oh, giant lichen. Okay. I think that is all. I don't see any more skooma laying around. So, okay, I guess we'll be on our way. So, yeah, I was going the wrong way, apparently. I didn't realize I was so off track. Me too. Murdering pirates is fun. That is not the right way. Broken Ore Grotto. Apparently you have a quest up here for something? Maybe I go up here and then swing around. I guess. Since we're already here. There must be something there. Oh, what's this? A fort? Oh, it's a lighthouse. It's a lighthouse. That makes sense. Doesn't look like much of a lighthouse. I mean, there's no light on it. Oh, rest in peace, mage light. Kindle light. John Breaker, where are you at? Hmm. We can go inside. We can also go up. I guess there is light up here. Couldn't see it from the ground, though, I suppose. That's not important, though, right? You just gotta be able to see it from out in the ocean. Let's see what's here, sure. Seems like these are friendlies. What are you doing that for? Sorry. Oh, my. Old Majaka is a visitor. Yes, you do. Until next time. Nice place you have here. Solitude Sewers, Cloaca Maxima. The heck does that mean? Will I get in trouble for opening this? I don't think we can do it, it's fine. 
So Master Lock, and it's something I don't understand. What, what does Cloaca Maxima mean? I don't even know. I must know what's here now, though. Not going to say anything. Not going to say anything about how I just spent two minutes on that stupid lock. Hello. Someone there? Can we one victory for well for now? Considered. Is this not gonna let me through? Guys, need you to take a step back so I can swing at this properly. Not sure if I can get in there without yeah, with you being there. Need like a fire spell or something? What's the deal here? I guess it specifically needed a fire spell. Okay, that's stupid. Whatever. Ah, <sighs> game. Really should cast my healing thing as well. Powerful healing oneself. Oh, I gotta un- I got this is- it's so dumb. This- this causes problems that I have to unbind that. There are some things about Requiem that are really annoying. Like, really, really annoying. Okay, Dawnbreaker on the right hand, and then we do this on the left. There we go. Just kind of clunky things, you know? I understand the reason from a role-playing perspective, but... But at the same time, it is really annoying. Ah, huh, Dwemer Ruins down here, huh? And this is open from here. I mean, I probably could get that chain from here. Just... Oh, wait. Can I? Oh, there's... there's it's here. Okay, never mind. So see, I could probably get that chain from here realistically. Like it seems silly that I can't, honestly. But you know, whatever. Is someone there? Come on. Victory or sword and Bro, you got wrecked. Sewer is a. Where does this go, I wonder? There you are. Hmm. Dwarven ruins, huh? <laughs> Can't go past, though. But yeah, there's like definitely. Definitely leads into some dwarven type stuff. Excuse me, Slaughterfish. If you could not take a bite out of me, that'd be Victory nice. This is, what is this? It's a clam. Oh, there's a hole here. Never should have come here. Well, you chose violence, buddy. It is what it is. Derelict tunnels. Then we have the option to go this way, too. There goes my light. Can I cast this?
Uh, where is this at? Who is lighting these torches to give us illumination back here? goes back outside to Skyrim. Warm up here by this giant roaring fire and dry off. Pretty sure if you're wet you take more electricity damage, but maybe you take less fire damage? I don't know. Almost there. I guess I could check. Look at the magic effects that we have going and see what, what it does. Wetness. Uh, weaker to shock and more resistant to fire. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Makes sense. We're gonna lose we're gonna lose that though. I think it goes by percentages, like it increases and decreases and such. Okay, are we good? One more tick. There we go, we're good. And this is the main area. Okay, so... Where does this go to? Tunnels. I guess this is one way to get into solitude, right? Oh, hello, hello. You're not planning on burning anything with that, are you? Oh, thank you. Here, have Divines a gold. Bless your kind heart. If I can have the buff. What was that? Hey, you actually attacked me. You sell stuff, huh? Take a look. Moon sugar, skooma. It's not very expensive. Definitely not like a thief type vendor. Moon sugar as well is pretty hard to come by and nice for some recipes. And I will just give you a bunch of, of these potions. Not even a bunch, just a couple. Yeah, it should be good. All right then. There's the outlaw refuge. Good doggy. Okay, outlaw refuge should have an easy access door to uh, solitude. Uh, you know, I guess we got to solitude one way or another, right? We certainly did. Yes. Until next time. What do you need? Hmm? This one needs something? All Sweet right, All right, then. Need something? Ah, so you're an alchemist, then. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'll just buy all your stuff, probably. Let's see here. Just gonna... Let's see. Total weight... Uh, no, I want to go to my stuff. Total weight, and, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna sell, like, all these resist poison, because I have better resist poison. It's worth quite a bit more. Pretty sure I have about, I would say, easily half a million septums in, uh, potions to sell at this point. 
I will take all of your various ingredients. Thanks very much. Even had an urn root for me. And then, what else do you have? Is that pretty much it? You do have a lot of potions. Like, decent potions, actually. Okay, nothing I particularly need. Good enough. All right then. Need something? Take a look. You don't have anything, but you can buy stuff, huh? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Enchanting training, huh? So you wish to master the arcane arts? Okay. Uh, sure. A new tomes here I could buy. I think I have all these. I think I might just have every single spell that the vendors sell. The ones I don't have are going to be like the rare ones that you find out in the wild. Uh, this one's new. And that's it. Okay. And then I'll take all of your soul gems, I think. And then you can have some of these crappy poisons, or some of these. Yeah, Poison to Frenzy. There you go. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes? Ooh, light armor training. You'll be able to run circles around those big, slow brutes in heavy armor. Ooh, that's actually quite tempting. Um... I could have my next evasion point right away. Oh, I've already trained this level. Damn it. Okay, but he can train me in, like, the highest level, or maybe the next to highest level. He could get me to 75 anyway. Hmm, I'm pretty close to leveling, so maybe I, if I level up when I'm around here, I could do that. That would be good. For now, though, let's go and take care of this um, guy who needs to be wabajacked, I guess. Because I keep forgetting to do it. Um, right, so. I've got a little work if you're interested, traveler. You know, I might come back and I talk to you. Death has turned the whole town on its head. After I do this real quick, I might come back and talk to you again, because you might lead into the Thieves' Guild quests, and I really would like to do some Thieves' Guild stuff. Because, um... I want to get my infinite lockpick thing that never breaks. Keep casting this candlelight. Should just bind this. Get on eight, there we go. Put this on nine, the Stonebreaker. Oh, there is no nine. Uh, seven. Okay, there we go. We don't have to keep going in there every single time to do that. What are you staring at? Should attempt robbery while he's drunk. That'd be very, uh, I don't know. Happens often. Yeah, yeah. Excuse you guys. I have a quest. Oh, this is the guy we're supposed to talk to. You've returned. Good. What did you find at Wolf Skull Cave? Oh, nothing much. Just some necromancers attempting to summon and bind Potema, you know, the Wolf Queen. Potema herself? Please tell me you stopped them. I did. You've done a larger service to the realm than you could possibly know. 
A resurrected Potema. I shudder at the thought. Hmm. Okay. Well, that led to an interesting thing. All right, we got to put on a real weapon for this. This will be an actual tough fight. Uh, let's pop some stuff. Well, we can go inside first. Actually, before we... Alright. I didn't even get through the goddamn door. Hold on. I want to wabajack him. Don't kill him! Damn it, I wanted to wabajack him. Guys, you killed him too fast. What's this letter say? Letter to Aberoth. Your weakness does not come from my magic, but from your lack of something. Mortals fade from visibility with less piteous cries than yours. What is it to you if we vanish from this realm? Our true home? Yes, home awaits. I can't read what the other one says, really. Uh, I will not cease, not until the gates of Oblivion are open once more and we stand before our Lord in triumph. You are the... Zoot? I think? <laughs> I don't know what that says. To trust these mortals, mortal couriers, with our letters... Uh, do not write to me again unless of court. Of course, Velocia miraculously returns as something other than a block of... What, cheese? I know what that was supposed to be. Guys, I was going to wabajack him. Well, whatever. I could have bound him as well. Guess I had to be all hasty, didn't you? It would have helped if the guy didn't freaking put me on my ass first thing I came through the door, too. That was also annoying. Alright, well, that's that, I suppose. Um, I wonder if we get a reward for taking care of the Pelagia Swing. <coughs> Does anybody care that I took care of that? What could it mean? The return of I've the got Dragonborn? A lot of respect for the restoration who among school? us could possibly hold that honor? Skyrim it's good to see, see you again. again. Soldiers could buy a house here, too. I have been meaning to buy a house somewhere else. Sure. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Yeah, sure. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. Decorations. I'd be glad to help you. There are many. And of course, now. What would you like to purchase? Um, let's see here. Yeah, we'll just take everything. Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Yeah, everything. Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Okay, so I guess I can have the kids' room in this place and also have um, my alchemy lab, so... Hey there! I can rent my house out. Interesting. Very well, I'll make the arrangements. Can I see for how long? Okay, interesting. Okay, stop running my house. Very well, I'll make the arrangements. Okay, that's fine. Keep safe. To harm Elisif in any way, and here to that you always reward, brighten my day a little. <laughs> she she's happy because I spend so much money here, <laughs> but but I have the response because initially she's really snooty of saying, uh, "What's your problem?" 
Um, okay, I have some petty soul gems you're looking for. Thank you. Here, this is for you. 300 septums. Well, I got a scroll too, I guess. Oh, all right. Um, how long have you been the court wizard? I was a member of the court during the reign of Torg's father. It was Torg who appointed me to the position. So you and the High King were close? Very. I helped raise him. Oh, I could not have been more proud to see Torg on the throne. He made a fine king. A fine king. Were you there when he died? I was, to my shame. The whole court was in attendance. I've seen much in my time, but that was a gruesome day. Why was he killed? Because Ulfric needed a symbol. Someone he could defeat that represented the Empire. The White Gold Concordat, the banning of Talos' worship. Torig's father Islot had held Skyrim together for nearly 25 years. When he died, Torg became that symbol. So the war started when Islot died? No. Even after Islot died, the Moot voted to make Torig High King of Skyrim. But Ulfric was at that Moot, continually talking about Skyrim's independence in terms just shy of treason. I don't think Ulfric knew how much Torig respected him for that. If Ulfric had asked Torig directly to stand up, to declare independence, Torig might have done it. Hmm. He just needed a push to go through with it. He wasn't sure of himself enough yet to do that. Probably. But let's ask, why didn't he declare dependence? Because the Dominion is a sleeping beast that Skyrim cannot slay alone. Because many Nords are part of the Imperial Army even now. Because the food and resources we get from the Empire are important to our people. Because even if we can't openly worship him, Talos the God was once Tiber Septim the man, and this is his empire. And Torg wasn't ready to let it fall apart. In these caravans will deter them hmm. In Those are good reasons. All right. Um, I just want to sell some stuff, Take though. I just blew a whole bunch of gold, so... You've got 20,000 for some reason, so awesome. Buy some crappy poison potions, please. And I will buy all of your soul gems. The irony is some of those I just sold to you, probably. All right, and uh, anything new for me in terms of spells? Uh, soothe rank two. Yeah, sure. Okay. And we'll just sell a couple more potions and be on our way. Wait, I, did I just buy that or did I sell that? I think I just sold that book to her. Oh, well, I don't care that much about that book. Whatever. Uh, it's fine. Um, Take care of yourself. Okay, I guess court's in session now. Did you know there was a Daedra... The There's something personal I was hoping you would do for me. Oh, really? Halt. What can I do for you? Falk told me what you did for us at Wolf Skull Cave. He says you're someone we can trust. As you may know, Talos' worship is outlawed in the Empire. When we buried my husband, I made offerings to all the gods, except Talos. I would like you to take an item of his, a warhorn handed down from his father, and place it at a shrine of Talos. Sure, I can do that. Do you worship Talos? No, but my husband, Torg, would want a proper burial, and this is the way Nords are buried in Skyrim. Sure, I can do that. Thank you. It would mean a lot to me. Wonder if this is the uh, way I can become Thane here. You hear that? I swear there's something out there. In the dark. I killed it. Don't worry about it. It's gone now. If you're referring to what I think you're referring to. Okay. Well. Mm -hmm. If I lost out on, like... 10,000 gold because I could have bought the house for cheaper. I don't really care that much. I do want to go and see my house, though. Let's see. Where, oh, where? I, I did see the place where you're supposed to rent out, I think. Previously, I'm pretty sure I saw it.
damn it. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, do that. Good. Now, candlelight. We are getting some alteration skill, which is nice. That's not the place. Thought it was like up around here somewhere. Please, game, thank you. Is it put on my map or give me a journal entry or anything? Doesn't look like it. Or maybe it's miscellaneous. I don't know. Oh yeah, here we go. This is the manor, your new home. I think I have to make miscellaneous active though. To be able to see it. Yeah, and I have a million miscellaneous quests here. Oh my god. Okay, um, it's over here, to the right. Proud Spire Manor. Ah, up here, okay. There are two entrances. Okay. Gotta admit, it's got better decoration at the very least than my other place. Also, a lot nicer food here. Proper serving dish. Does it come with a servant, too? Is that just floating there? I think it is. Well, we're gonna ignore that. Is this my, ch is this my children's room? Why have you never taken a wife? Yo, chill out with all that. Is this my cut my child's room? Just a sleeping bag on the ground? And this is an upside down chair that's supposed to have a table here, I think? Maybe. Hmm. Here's my alchemy lab. This is a nice alchemy lab. It looks really cool. So this is the the full alchemy lab. Oh, we get a whole bunch of um stuff here, huh? Okay, so I can keep... This is kind of nice. I can keep potions here. Um, I can keep my alchemical, re alchemical reagents in the cupboard here. And then I have a potion self to shelf to store potions properly. That's kind of cool. Another cupboard here for different, different stuff. Nice cooking fire here in a proper kitchen. This is a proper kitchen. Got our oven over here. We got a cooking pot beside the stove here. Place for keeping all of our various ingredients if we want to. Got a nice bar here as well. I can serve you. This is okay. I, I gotta admit, guys, this is a better house than Breeze Home for sure. It's a better place. I'll admit it. We got three floors. Yeah, three whole floors. Here is the enchanting. Ooh, and display area. We got what? Master... Uh, this. Oh, look. I've got a bunch of bedrooms here. Two beds here. Master bedroom here. Yeah, unusual gem. Do I have to... There's like 20 of those, right? Do I have to buy every house, get all the unusual gems? I might. That might be a thing. Random tundra cotton putting on my bed. Just for decor, I guess. Nice uh, desk over here. East Empire shipping map. It's interesting. Wonder if that does anything. Hmm. 
Nice library over here. Even more room for books. A wash? No, not a wash basin. Just a wardrobe. Weapon rack. If you wanted to roleplay really hard, you could, like, come home and put your weapon here and lay down and go to bed, but, like, uh, it's too much work, guys. That's way too much work for me. Okay, so yeah, we got, like, room here for the kids. We got plenty of storage for ourselves. There's a lower level, too, which I haven't even looked at yet. The very bottom. Trophy base. Probably is a... Wow, that, okay. Yeah, I don't know. This is a pretty nice... Pretty nice bath, guys. It's got its own fountain. It's got hot bubbling springs coming up. Probably like hot enchanted springs. What? What is it? What is that? Just saw something. Oh, just a bench. Nice stone bench. It's pretty nice. And here's the workshop proper. Only bad part is that the uh, alchemical stuff is up upstairs. It's not down here. But I mean, it's a very well appointed place. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. And this is a lower level, I see. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, guys. This is, this is a pretty cool house. I like it. It's kind of all the way up here north, though, you know? This goes back outside. Okay. That's the house tour. All right. I mean, it's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. I like this house a lot. Um, but for now, let's uh, let's go and get some rest. And we'll do more stuff in the morning. Okay. We also have to deliver a book to the Bard's College. Let's do that real quick, too. I'll be the opposite way over here. down here, actually. You guys notice the Bard's College in Solitude? Got a book for delivery to someone. Ah, there they are. Morning. Gerard. Brilliant. I have a delivery from Andonato Leotelli. Ah, yes. Adonato's new work. Shorter than I expected, but words must be judged on merit. Not I'll look over this later. Why don't you take this for your trouble? Ah, you can do speech training. I suppose I should return to my papers. Alrighty. Simple enough. Let's get out of here, then. Okay, next quest. Anything around here, miscellaneous-wise? I don't think so. I'd say we can be on our way now. Okay, um, oh right, she wanted, uh, she wanted me to bury something of, of her husband, right? Uh, let's see. Where is this, what is this quest though? Is it miscellaneous? Yeah, take the Warhorn. Where is that at? Somewhere nearby here. Would make sense if it was nearby. Doesn't necessarily mean it is, though. Um, I 
Whoa, all the way over here? No, that's that's a different quest. I want to take the war horn. Well, there's a couple places we have quests for. One is Fogunther. I do remember this one mentioning that. It's right here. We might as well go and check it out while we're here. Maybe Ustengrav as well. Oh, no, this is this is the vampire thing. No, oh, okay. I don't, I don't know what deal is. Let's go and do that. That sounds fun. Raiding a big dungeon sounds fun. Or do we want to talk to that Argonian and see what he wants from us? Maybe he'll have Thieves Guild work for us. Start us down that path. The battlefield is full of distractions. Ignore them. Focus on your target. This the Smith. Glad you're here. Hmm. Blades, helmets. Yeah, I'll sell some stuff Pretty real quick. Anything to suit your needs. Is it supposed to be a cat in the background, or is it supposed to be a kid? It's supposed to be a baby. I can't ever tell. All right, what do you have? Any? You have Moonstone and Quicksilver, I guess. I could do that. Galatite's 2 is pretty good. You've done well for yourself since I've been away, but no uh, no Ebony, I see. It's unfortunate. Well, it is what it is. Any Ebony ingots? No. Or ores, that is. Doesn't look like it. Anything good? Not really. Ebony gear? No. Not much that really matters here. Okay, I'll just say a couple more potions and we'll be on our way. Keep safe. That Argonian should be right over here. Yes. You're passing through solitude? Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? Okay, I'm listening. It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground, or just left lying around in someone's house. I bet the two of us were very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. My sister Deja and I are treasure hunters. We like to collect things. Okay. Just Oop. remember, I'm here if you rethink your decision. What was your suggestion again? I'm not sure why I exited that. As I said, it's easy to find things nobody will miss. My sister DJ and I are treasure hunters. You could be too. What's your offer? With the war, many more ships come through these docks. Loaded with weapons and pay, but few people and they pass through dangerous waters. We have an interest in one of those boats, the Ice Runner. The Solitude Lighthouse will be guiding it in, but if its fire were to go out, the Ice Runner would run aground. Everyone knows General Tullius wields the real power in Solitude. You want me to set up a wreck? You want me to put out the fire? What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. And what about the sailors on the boat? On the boat? Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from their sad crash. Well, you've removed all my moral obligations, uh, or my moral objections from this, so sure. I knew you looked like a clever one. It would be best if we spoke little until you've completed your task. Yeah, I would, you know, if, if, if we're going to kill people, I'll feel real bad, but if the sailor's going to be okay, feel then... Feel free to look around. Well... We have a fine selection of herbs here at Angela's Aromatic. It's good to see a fresh face. Take a look. 
I want to buy all your stuff and sell all your... I want to buy all your ingredients. And I'm going to sell you a bunch of crap. A bunch of crappy potions that no one would ever in their right mind use. But sell for a lot of money for some reason because... Because Skyrim. Actually, that's not necessarily true. Wait, did I sell her my stuff? Did I, I didn't do that wrong, did I? No, 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 we're good. Yeah, we're good. I thought for a second I sold her my ingredients and I was going to be very upset. Yeah, take some resist poison potions. I mean, I guess these are useful, you know, if you're poisoned. Can make much better ones. Don't tell anyone that, though. I got all but one gold. Nice. Don't forget the <coughs> next time you need herbs and potions. Yeah, general trader here too. I guess I'm just gonna sell stuff to everyone around here. Welcome to bits and pieces. I'm sure you'll find what you need here. Hmm? She's so nice since I uh bought a whole bunch of stuff from her. She's like really mean at first, but now she's nice. I guess because I bought so much from her. You got any ebony? Ingots or ore? No, look, you got soul gems though. Sure, I'll take those. Uh, okay. Anything else here? Not really. Okay, time to sell you some crap. Have some of these potions. That should do. Thank you. Come back to bits and pieces anytime. If I get over a million gold, is the game going to bug out? I am kind of curious about that. Wouldn't want that to happen. Assume that has to have been fixed, probably. That's the inn. You know you can afford a septum or two. Sure. Lisette, spare some glass. Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. Get better prices on stuff when you do that. I'm pretty sure. And shut the door. What delight. Another charming customer. Oh wait, she's the one that's a bitch, not the other one. You have a bad day? It is when my customers waste time chatting and not buying. You do a lot of business like that? Radiant Raiment has the finest attire in all of Skyrim. That is how we get business. Okay, so just... Let's see if we can't find an outfit that suits you. Get to be a bitch because you have nice stuff. I see. 15% alchemy. That might be better than mine, but it's not peerless. I'd be looking for peerless alchemy stuff. Or maybe making it myself. You do have a lot of stuff, that's for sure. Like a lot of it. Dunmer tunic, huh? Gives magic regen. Pretty cool. You really do have a ridiculous amount of stuff for sale. Nothing that I need, really. Uh, any ingots that I want? Not really. I will take all your soul gems. Crappy as they are. And you get some potions, too. There Finally. you go. Okay, that should be everyone. There's this East Empire Trading Company, too, but I don't know that I've really ever been able to interact with them or anything. Let's go up there. No, it was just like an upper walkway. Can I just jump outside of here? No, you can't. You can see out, but you can't jump outside. Have to use the proper door for that. Gotta maintain the illusion, you know? Okay, so we have to go and ret or return this horn.
no, we don't have to do that right now. We're gonna go to Folgenther instead, because that sounds more fun. Um, I can probably just swim across or something. Gotta go to the lighthouse anyway, right? So... Why don't we go over there and do that real quick. We will want to be stealthy about it, but it shouldn't be too hard. Where are you at, Frost? There you are. Alright, where are we going? I want to go up this way. Not sure... Well, I went through the sewers before. Maybe I won't go up there. Be kind of a pain in the butt. Maybe we'll do that later on, towards the end of the night. Because if we put the fire out now, someone could just stop by and redo the fire, and then... What good would that do? What's up this way? Who knows? I've never gone up this way before. Maybe I have. I don't know. Let's put our one-hander back on unless we need to use something else. The Thalmor Embassy. Wow, I've never wanted to go in on a murdering spree anymore in my life. Bunch of snooty elves in here. If I murder everyone but there's no witnesses, oh, we can't get inside. I see. If you like, uh... Wait, what? But I didn't... I didn't do anything. I'm just walking around outside. Did my companions attack? I wouldn't just get a bounty added to me or anything. I was just thinking about murder. I didn't do the murder yet. Come on now. It's not fair. What the hell? Didn't activate you, Goldier, and you're also like 10 miles away. Hey, look, I was just thinking about murdering you. I didn't actually do it. I think I think one of my companions got inside somehow, though. Okay, well, that's where the embassy is, I suppose. That kind of scared me, I'm not going to lie. Her <laughs> just appearing like that. Anything up here? Doesn't look like it. I'm thinking that Fulgunthar has to be a, a dragon worship place, right? That's why I want to go there. Maybe find some more dragon stuff. Oh, hey, it's uh, Dwemer stuff. Dwemer ruins. Nothing up there, though. Maybe there was at one time. Sometimes ruins are just ruins. There's nothing interesting there, you know? Just some old ruins that don't lead anywhere particularly of note. Okay, let's let's go to Vol Fulgenther then. Let's go back down through this way. I got distracted, guys. Sorry. Don't know why I apologize. Getting distracted in Skyrim is half the fun. Uh, Stormcloak camp. Interesting. Pardon me. That is interesting. There's a Stormcloak camp so close to the Thalmor Embassy. an easy way to get down there, is there?
Don't mind me. Looks like gallop through your camp. Yes, we'll go around this way and over that bridge. Some ruins? Yeah, those are ruins. What is up there? Who are you guys? Make it quick. Oh, it's the patrolling Thalmor people. Wait, this is Meridia's temple, isn't it? Yes, okay. Oh, yeah, Derp, it's Meridia's temple. Okay. We were just here. Very recently, too. Do you guys know there's a Stormcloak camp just down the way? Should uh, go fight him. I'm sure it would work out well for you. Okay, so the bridge is over here. We're down here a short ways. This is the Dragon Bridge camp. Carriage there, but no, no actual carriage. Um, do you sell horses? Make yourself useful and chop up some firewood. There's a few coins in it for you. You having some trouble with your wife? I didn't hear anything about this, but sure. Her name's Olda. If you've met her, then you probably already know what I'm talking about. I swear that woman is the most spiteful shrew in all of Skyrim. I think there's a chunk of ice where her heart ought to be. Okay. Honest gold for honest work. Oh wait, I didn't want to sell my... I wanted to see Take what you had to say. Oh, I wanted to buy your wood, not sell my wood to you. Give me that wood, thank you. Uh -huh. I can't buy... horses here, can I? This is not really a stable. Not really, they're not selling stuff anyway. Doesn't look like it. I could probably steal some horses from here though if I was careful about it. Excuse me, Goldier. Sorry. Okay, Fulgurther is over this way. my orientation here. Mining, are we? Where? Oh, there you are. Hi. It's some iron, huh? If you know any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to Windhelm. Ulfric Stormcloak wants to see them. Okay, it's all the way over here across this swampy area. Whoop! Hey, look at this troll. They're gonna kill him, though. I just know my companions are gonna kill him. Can you stop it with the horse, though? I really didn't want you to fight the horse. I just... Okay, he's dead. They're gonna kill him. I wanted to use him for a punching bag, dang it. Next time I see it come across a, a troll like this, a higher level troll, I'll just tell my guys to hang back. I guess I could go through here and loot stuff. There are a lot of alchemy ingredients through here to loot. 
Though death bells in particular, I'm not really sure they're that useful for alchemy. Oh, tardiness. I can make tardiness potions with them. It's good. Such a shame I had to kill this horrendous spider. Oh no. We're all very sad about that, I'm sure. Not another bad. day, Not another bad. victory. One, the smiter of mud crabs. Get up there. This kind of looks like uh, ruins-ish, you know? That's the boat I found previously, I think. One with the skooma and stuff on it. Power attacks really do do quite a bit more damage. I guess I can put on my dragon bone. Oh boy, freezing up. There we go. Dragon bone. Hunting knife. My other hand. Ooh, what happened here? Someone had a bad time. I mean, this place is filled with spiders and other nasties, so I guess it's not that surprising, but still. Could shout these deer down, you know? Could do a wold as well. Even that I can't catch him. How am I not hitting him? Got him. Foolish mud crabs. The locked room and a key for what? Did I get the key or did the key fall through the world? I think it fell through the world. I'm pretty sure there was a key on that. Maybe it was just a visual of a key. Just a picture of a key on the front of it. And I'm just a dummy. Entirely possible. Where did you come from? Come on. 
My character is just so much stronger now than he used to be. He just brute fro oh my god, I can't talk. He can just brute force his way through so many things now. What is this? I should save as well. I haven't saved for a while. Is someone there? Fort Snowhawk. It's a bunch of uh, mages and such. Was I here before? What? You yield? Too late. Bad, you were sitting down the job. Should probably use my shouts to make sure I can stun these guys and stop them from running away. Smiting the undead. Random Imperial. Good job. level are you guys, by the way? Yeah, you, they level up pretty high. 51. I don't think there's a level cap in this like there is in the base game. People warn me about that, that there's a level cap in the base game and they'll stop being useful after a while. It doesn't seem like that. It seems like they go up infinitely as long as you keep leveling up with them. I think maybe all companions are just like equal to your level. Wait, that's Ilya! Oh god. Ilya, you scared me. I saw magic and I, I saw red. I almost killed you. It's okay, I turned away at the last second. So that's all here. That was too close. Excuse me? Oh crap, it goes outside. Dang it. Did not realize that. Back inside we go, men. And women. Didn't notice one outside. I am so used to moving forward. No mercy. Get him, Goldier. Smite evil. Good job, Goldier. Many wood, vampires? Golder always lets me know when there's vampires nearby. Hmm. Can't get through that way. Um... What? Hello? 
Necromage is necromancer. Aren't you hostile? You're not- oh, whatever. You're not fighting though. Good job. Good looking out. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you not hostile? Hey, you getting late. Whoa. What the hell just happened? Did you, did you guys just kill each other on accident? What just happened? Is that a magical misfire? Didn't even have to kill him. Wound up killing each other. There is a steel shield there. I could use that shield, but is that a piece of heavy armor? Hold on. Yeah, it's heavy. I don't really want a heavy one. I'd want a lighter shield. I wouldn't mind using a shield for, like, bashing and stuff. It'd be kind of nice. I think one-handed shield is very, very effective, actually. And some of the, like, the shield artifacts are amazing. Ooh. Did I just shove my sword... Up the neck into his skull. That's rough, bro. I guess it was quick, though. Porter's key. Etiquette with rules. Whoa, bunch of stuff. Bunch of Atronach Forge recipes. Give me all the things. Noble Squire. This might be better than the one I have. Glass great sort of thunderbolts. Pretty nice. This is too. I mean, holy crap. 3,000. That's maybe worth taking. Some soul gems. Mage coat rank 2. I think I have that already. I just haven't actually read it yet. It's just, it's in my inventory. It's a very tiny crate. Are we good? Is there anything else in here? So that goes back outside. Oh, there's an uh, enchanting table here. Dance in the fire. Hey, it's a block book. What's this say? A letter from a necromancer. Milady, we have driven the last of the bandits from Fort Snowhawk. Regretfully, the North Tower suffered some major damage in the final assault, but repairs are already underway. As you predicted, the fort should be ide an ideal site for our experiments. Much of it is ruined, of course, but its close proximity to the northern road should ensure us a steady supply of test subjects. We hope to have some preliminary results in the next few weeks. So they were setting this up for someone else. So who was their, their um, funder or proprietor or whatever you want to... Who was their person in charge? Would be the real question. I can check to see what... Um, if anything, I can use to temper this thing, too, I suppose. Let's see. Dawnbreaker. Yeah, it just uses silver. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, I can temper this further as well. Like, I can make this even better. If I had my, uh... My smithing stuff on, it would go quite a bit higher. Like, 50% higher, probably. Not a bad little hideout here, though. Got quite a bit of alchemical ingredients, and... Got an alchemy lab, we got an enchanting station, got a weapon wheel. They have a forge here? 
think there is a forge outside. Not sure if they have a... Um, well, of course, the thing is, like, this place would be hell to take over. It's, it'd be way too hard to take this over at a low level, so... My thought of making this as a low-level base is probably not really in any way valid. Just wouldn't work out because people here are way too strong. But it would make an excellent base if you didn't have a house, you know? Alrighty, and this opens up that door that we saw earlier, and then we go right back outside. Nice. Okay, all clear. Okay, I'm gonna call it good here for this episode, guys. There might be more out over here, I don't know. We'll see. But we'll figure it out next time. Thanks for watching.